All right, everybody, welcome. <clears throat> welcome back to another B&D's landscaping video. Hey, we're going to be doing a 100-hour review on the deer right there. I just said I was going to do it when I'm done a walk around with the X mark. But so far, I'll do another quick walk. You know, all the video. I've put nine so far. Nine hours on it. Absolutely love it. Cuts great. But anyway, that's not today's video. Today's video is about this. It's a 2020 John Deere E100. I just went down to the store this morning down there to put to put gas in it. And yeah, I really had no complaints over it. Um only thing i do have a complaint about is this seat right here over the past hundred hours it's tore like really easily but other than that like you got you got your gas tank here and then your throttle gear box fuel thing down there and then um you have you know your basic hood stuff kind of with the 17 and a half horsepower motor by I think it's by Briggs but I don't know it yeah it's by see Briggs and Stratton logo right there so you got your battery never really had to point out the battery it's held up good the past 100 hours and I've kept the oil change done the oil change myself on it change the oil filter and like I said I never really had anything anything really go wrong with it but there's the hour meter right there 202 hours so it's i mean it's pretty old but i'm gonna put it i wonder where i'm gonna put it out i just cleaned out the spot over here on this side for it i'm gonna hopefully put it right there and i got that zero turn there with all the junk that was sitting over here i put it on that one with all the fishing poles tackle boxes leaf blowers stuff and then got the weeder there dream catcher <laughs> we got the x mark there and then two push mowers yeah i'll get a start up like i'll hear the start up and put the blade on see it's not it's not really that loud i mean you got both the mower zero turn mowers are louder than that basically all and you got all of your all of your deck stuff down here all your belts and pulleys which one time when it hit around i per se maybe 50 hours it this deck belt right here snapped but that i think that was mainly when the people put together it was didn't know what they're doing but that's what it looks like when it's engaged and then when it's disengaged 
Don't move a lot, but it still moves a little bit to where it can still run. <laughs> but yeah, that's basically it for the walk around of the 100 hour review on the deer. Like I said, the only major complaint is I have is that seat that's ripped real pretty bad. But other than that, and I bought this, bought this bumper here aftermarket to go on it. But really, other than that, I ain't got no complaints. But yeah, and I bought this steering thing here. You can drive it with one hand if you really want to. Now, we can go to the trailer. This is a new trailer we bought a few days back. I just had pressure wash it like Saturday and it's well it's good for what we need it for. We bought a second hand to use. I give fifteen hundred dollars for it. Got your ramp right there and you got which I mean it hauls both both zero both zero turns pretty well. Here in the next coming up months, I'm gonna put a box and we'll run it from here, go across that beam and go down, put a box right here. But yeah, I guess that's it for this video, guys. I'll talk to y'all whenever. I don't know when the next video will be though. But yeah, I guess that's the hundred hour review. Alright, um, well, I wouldn't, wouldn't really plan on doing this, but I'll do it anyway. But that's what it looks like in the building now. I got... No, I got this put in here. I had to pick up the front, like, with my muscle and put it over here. Put one push mower set in here, but I don't know what I'm going to do with that. Yeah, I don't know. But I'm going to figure that out when, we, when it comes to it. Yeah, I guess it's in a video. Another 100 hour view on a deer, so. Quick, quick and short to show y'all what it looks like. <clears throat> so. Yeah, I guess I'll see y'all in the next one. Bye.